Welcome to a new Let's Play with some of our mistakes. We today are getting the top dressing done on our crops. We not do a great deal at a time, but we will get through, get the fertilizer on, and then we will come up towards harvest. There is a great opportunity arising in front. Somebody we know over there is retiring. And we may well move to France, which will mean among the arable crops we will be making the grapes for the wine. So we shall see where that goes going forward. Well now, concentrating here on Sussex Farm a fairly big area we've got to fertilise today. Once we get all this harvested, we can then move over over here. Go the old very well. We shall keep stopping the machine and starting it to get us all up the hill. And uh, yeah, was a little bit steady getting up the hill. We will get the fertilising done, and then if it needs any I may go crossways onto the field just because of that hill in here, which slows us down. But we are getting around quickly now. <coughs> Use 20% of our seed, uh, seed fertilizer at the minute. But if we go to France, we may buy a new grey fergie going forward. Uh, yeah, we decided that the Christmas special is going to be a little bit different to what normally people do. We are going to take a look, pick our favourite mods, the farming simulator from 2019, and that will then. See how we go from there. I think it'd be a good idea to recognise the great modders out there as favourite mods. One mod would have been my favourite, but it's a private mod, so we're not allowed to have it. Which is, well, a couple of mods would have been in the favourite list the Ports and Major and the David Brown in 1200 or 990, whatever it was. They would have been nice to have had, would have fitted in well going forward in this series. But pull now, here doing the top dressing, we are on D7 spring, late spring, and it is Sunday, May the 18th. Ooh, a bit of a bounce there on the tractor. 
<coughs> we should get this field done quite easily today and possibly the next one. May even get the potatoes done all day. <laughs> Using a lot of fuel. It's already used a quarter of a tank of fuel on our little TE20. Uh, everything looking good thus far for our crops. Every time you put the PTO in, it picks the front wheels up and just throws you a little bit off course. But Very pergy. Ideal on this little fertiliser chucker. We shall get the fertilising done, we shall get some spraying done if we need any. Away we go again. Almost got the longest of the rows done. We may well get this field done with the fertiliser we've got in the bin, or almost done, which will be good. Uh, yeah, looking forward, we have put in an offer for the farm in France. It will mean that we leave Lincolnshire and we leave Sussex and we go to France. I left Lincolnshire to come here to farm in Sussex and to go as an expat and farm in France, exciting times ahead. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, this will be the last of the longer rows through here. I'm not sure. Get the shorter rows done. We've used almost half a tank of fuel, although it's not. be long before we're finished in the field now. There's a little sliver there so we will put a bit extra on the outside but <coughs> everything working well for us at the minute. And we will keep going, work the day out as much fertilised as we can today and then be too long now before we are coming back with an harvest. Looking forward to getting this harvest out. Good thing about the farm we're buying in France is that the fields are smaller, more manageable for the grey fergies which, let's face it, the best tractors to use in the 50s. bit underpowered this one but the next one we plan on getting will have double the power which will help out a great deal once we get over to France. Oh, now almost finished with this field. One bin of fertiliser is going to just about finish it. <coughs> we'll have to top up the fuel as well before we go much further. We've already used our tank of fuel and this fertiliser spread. Everything is working nicely for us. So we have gone the opposite way on to what we drilled it. But the tractor can't cope too well with the hills 
around here. Reach on now. Get down this breed. Um, no, it looks like it's spreading the last of it, so that is good. We shall head over to the trailer, fill up with fuel, and then head over to our next field, which is just the other side of the yard. One field fertilised. Weeds growing around the outside here. Not to worry. Money shall now top our soles up with fuel. get ourselves round to the next field, get everything in line on the tandem. Do for that, we shall also take the Land Rover over with us as well. When we move to France we will buy ourselves a smaller trailer to put on the back of the Land Rover to put our fuel in to take to the yard, away from the yard fields. Everything is looking good, they are following nicely. And in here is the next field we have to do. We will get everything parked up in here. Better just put a bit more fertilizer in here before we set off. Just lift a little bit. We have got the bags on. So it does work nicely for us. It still pulls it up the front when you start it up. I've got the potatoes to fertilise as well before we move away from the main farm tomorrow. So, uh, yeah, everything's looking good. Everything looking good. We should go around the outside of this. is all over with this old girl. She has got some weight on the front as well, so had we not put the weight on when we got the option to buy, we would have really struggled with these jobs. fertilised and then we shall next time you join us we'll be over at the next field a bit of transporting to do to get us all round there but we've got a bit of a, a fence here so we'll have to reverse up Now before we move to France, we shall 
well get this field done may well get a start in the potato field as well it will leave the fertilizer where it is probably won't need too much more of it job this, hopefully it doesn't roll over. Yeah, the move to France, we have signed an intent to buy, we've got to sort out about getting permission from the French government to live in France permission from the French government to buy a farm in France and get all the bits sorted out. The guy who's selling apparently isn't selling up until the end of harvest anyway so not got too much rush to get ourselves over there may well leave here in the winter to store our equipment somewhere in France until we can take over the farm and now we've got one more three just to go down and we shall go down the potato field get the headlands done I'm starting here, I've got about 10 minutes left to do so we may well get all the fertilising done down here whilst we are down here we shall now go down and bounce there so yeah we've got some we haven't left the gaps at the end like we do in modern times farming in the 50s was all about making money everything growing. Yeah, this is quickly over to get all this done. Whoa, another big bounce there from the tractor. There it is. 20 past 12 at the minute, so the day is working out pretty quickly. We'll speed it up time a little bit so we can slow it down a little bit for harvest. We shall keep recording until we've finished the potatoes be it a little bit shorter video, be it a little bit longer video. Yeah, this end will be done. Two more fields to get fertilised in the next game day. Down this last end when we go. Make sure we catch everything. I've got a bad spin on it for this, spread on it for a li little spreader. 55% oh, full, so we should get all of this field done with the fertiliser we've got in the tank. At the minute, there we go, that will do us nicely. Follow this row down. Too wide there, better. 
get this all now. May have missed a little bit just at the end of this row, but nothing to worry ourselves about. Potatoes growing nicely as well. It is only only May, so we can't expect it to be too well advanced. working as it should here. Right, one more breed to go. Not going to be too bad. We've done 20 minutes recording at the minute. And by the time we get everything back to the yard, it's going to be about a right sized video for you. breed now that's it it's got all the potatoes and the wheat fertilized we now have to pop over and get the, the barley and the oats fertilized in the next episode we should get all this lot to the yard Before heading over to the next field, which we may actually head over to the next field and then that is where we will leave you. We've got this little store, potato shed, this little shed here where we're going to store most of our stuff so as we head over ready for the next field hope you've enjoyed this episode here on Sussex Farm please give us a like give us a share drop us a comment if you're new to Summer Farm Estates and you'd like to see more of the work we do here please subscribe to the channel give that bell a tinkle it will tell you when we do these videos when we do a live streams until you join us next time thank you very much for watching hope you have a great day goodbye for now